This is a short tutorial on calculating torques based off of something like this. So we all know what this is, right? It's a torque wrench. I happen to have a, uh, a use for this crow's foot, which I made with a bolt that's welded. But what I need is to torque what's on the end of this crow's foot. Now, this wrench, how it would work is it would look like something like that, and I would torque it. However, since we are now offset from the center line, we add additional length to the torque wrench. So, for example, if it's 55 foot-pounds as the specification, if I throw this extra happens to be inch and three quarters on, if I go 55 on this end, it will be more. Okay, so there is a math formula. So if you have offsets like that, with something like this, or even something even longer, there's actually a calculation. So here's the formula. The formula is torque times length divided by length times the extra length in case this from center line to uh, center of the bolt equals our new torque. So we'll call that Y. So we're solving for Y, right? Well, there's a few things you gotta do. First of all, you gotta know what your torque is that you want to tighten it to. In our case, it's going to be 55 foot-pounds. Times length. Happens to be, and length is the center line of the head of the torque wrench. And this happens to have a flex, um, a flex handle, usually the middle of the handle, roughly. This is 17 inches. Now, before, before you go right down 17 inches, you know this is with foot pounds, right? And now you're throwing inches at it. You need to convert the 17 inches to feet. So I did that already. Um, I'm not gonna go through that conversion, but it's 1.416 feet. All right, so there's the top part. Our bottom part is our length again. Okay, so 1.416 feet. And I made an error. This is not a times, this is a plus. That's a plus sign. So plus E. E is the distance of your new addition to your torque wrench, the distance from the center line of where it is on the torque wrench and the new center line of the bolt and I calculate that as 1.75 inches or in our case 0 0.145 feet. That will calculate the new torque. So the without the torque wrench it's 55 foot pounds. Let's see how much of a difference it is. So I need a calculator. And how math works is you do 55 times this top one first. So 55 times 1.416, that's 77.88. Divided by this plus this, 5.56. Almost there. Now, 77.88 divided by 1.556 50 so with at uh, 50.05 but 50 just say 50 so with only an inch and three quarters added on the end of this we really need to take when we tighten down to 55 newton meters or not newton meters i'm sorry foot pounds we really, with this extension on here, need to go 50 on here. So that's important to take a note, especially if you're 
Um, you know, five foot pounds is not a lot, but if you're working with something delicate or something where torque is very, very important, that's a big deal.